Number 3. How to be a sustainable entrepreneur. Your contribution. In our last video, we got to know the United Nations Sustainable Development Goals. Now I would like to explain to you what you can contribute as a sustainable entrepreneur. Every business decision will have an impact on the environment. Whether you call yourself an ecopreneur, a social or sustainable entrepreneur, your mission is to solve an existing problem while usefully contributing to the goal of sustainable development. How can you accomplish that? Here are some recommendations and inspirations for direct actions you can take. Number 1. Your employees are a valuable resource. Your co-workers and you together work towards your business's vision. Therefore, treat your employees fair. If it is usual in your country, conclude contracts. With fair conditions such as maternity leave and sickness leave regulation. Number 2. Incorporate a strong vision and mission from the beginning. It keeps the company on the sustainable track. Furthermore, your employees will orientate themselves towards sustainability and will continue making decisions on the company's behalf. Number 3. Shift from throughput to circular manufacturing. Our current situation is that we produce goods in a linear production process, also called cradle to grave. That means we take resources, make something out of it, and after some time we dispose it. The idea behind circular economy is designing products that can be made to be made again. During the drafting it is necessary to think about the end of the product's life cycle. The goods of today will become the resources of tomorrow. Number 4. Avoiding future financial liabilities, such as the potential cost of contaminated land cleanup. The production process shall be designed as sustainable as possible. This may include the favouring of domestic production instead of shifting the production overseas. Number 5. Know who you work with. Your business partners ideally should share your business values. Before committing to a long-term relationship, check the background of your partner's business. Are there any events known in which your supplier acted unethically? What do you know about the company culture that is cultivated? Number 6. Prevent unnecessary waste. It starts in your office environment. Use less paper and consider alternative paper. Distribute memos via email and avoid printing in colour. Before you consider a business trip, offer telecommuting and video conferences. Number 7. Use regenerative energy. Many utility companies generate their electricity using wind or other alternative energy sources. Number 8. Involve the community. Helping others brings value to the community and brings more growth opportunities for everyone.